Good morning guys, it's Monday, it's me, Matt, and I'm back again with another review from the Billy Berserker. Hope you're having a fantastic weekend, hope you survived the storm. It's still bloody windy out there, but at least it's not raining. We had to batten down the hatches yesterday, we had water coming through virtually all the windows, and yeah, it was great fun. Probably had about two hours sleep last night, because you don't know. Well, weather forecast, especially here on the coast, is never that accurate, so I had to stay awake pretty much most of the night just in case it rained again and we got flooded because we have been flooded in the past. Touch wood, we survived, but I hope you guys are doing well. It's Monday, still blinking cold out there, and I have another review for you. Before we start, thank you so, so much from the bottom of my heart to each and every single one of you guys out there that's watching my videos, liking them, commenting on them. I do read and will respond to each and every single comment that is made. And I know I say each and every single time, but this is where I'm trying my hardest over there on Instagram as Viking Beard Matt and on my YouTube channel to help support, promote, advertise small brands, individuals and craftsmen out there and show you that there are people making some amazing things, whatever it might be from beard products, skin products, hair products, clothing, jewelry, all sorts of bits and pieces which we really need to get behind these small brands, help them and support them as much as we possibly can and not these big faceless horrible brands that are just pumping stuff out from their factories, don't really care about it and I am finding with the smaller brands that they're putting so much more time, passion and energy into it to creating the best products that they possibly can. So with all the reviews that I do on my channel, stuff that I go out and buy myself, stuff that gets sent through to me, all of my reviews that I do are completely honest. Everything I do is my own opinion and I'm completely unbiased. If there's a reason I don't like a product, I will constructively obviously say why I don't like it. And if there's a reason I do love a product, I will say why I do like it. As with all reviews I do, links will be down below in that description box. If you are enjoying my content and liking my videos, please hit that subscribe button and like the videos. I'm trying my hardest as much as one single old man can with his iPad in front of him and uploading the videos. So if you are expecting flashy graphics popping in and out and everything else, you're not going to be getting it here because the most I can do is edit it on my camera roll, upload it onto YouTube and there it sits. So if you are a small brand and you need any help, support, whatever, please get in touch with me. I'd love to hear from you and I really, really want to keep this channel going. So much passion behind what I'm doing here uh, that I actually enjoy doing this. It's not a chore. And I just want to keep getting better and better at what I am doing and hopefully you guys are liking it. So this has been kindly sent through a few days ago from a chap called Tim um, on Instagram as Spark240, who is basically owner and creator of Studio Wear and Cheeky Music Recording. He is a musician and a recording engineer. Obviously, as a musician, I play the guitar and keyboard. I play the keyboard a lot better than I play the guitar and I also sing as well. Don't ask me to sing. It's too early for that. Let's face it, it's ten, uh, nine in the morning. And he was kind of disappointed that there wasn't enough clothing and products out there for musicians, recording artists and stuff like that. So he decided to start creating uh, studio wear and cheeky music recording and creating his own clothing. And Stephanie is very, very kindly. Thank you so much, Tim. Sent me through a few bits to have a look at, see what I think of, give you guys my honest opinion. So inside was a letter. Hi Matt, apologies for the basic note. Studio Wear Tees is a startup idea as I realised there were plenty of guitar tees out there but not much in the way of other musician related stuff. I have currently a few independent music shops and popular YouTube guitarists helping with promotions plus the website is undergoing some changes soon. Really appreciate your help with the reviews. Uh, so just you were aware... So just so you are aware of the process, I use Dropship service with Ink Threadable as the product provider and EKM as the website shop window that has lots of tea suppliers do it so you don't have to carry stock. I've been through a few supplies of samples and hopefully yours is okay. I sent out the enamel mug as they are a little more robust and look cool but get a bit hot. Those standard china mugs are slightly larger and cheaper. Hope you enjoy the product. Regards, Tim. 
thank you so so much for the note and i do appreciate all the notes uh handwritten notes and type notes and stuff that come through when they do the reviews because it just shows me that someone has a bit more passion in what they're doing in creating the product and wants to get over their sort of passion and what they're doing. So also in here, with some business cards, studiowear.co.uk, clothing and merchandise, studiowear at yahoo.com. Tim Morris, who's on Facebook as well, as well as Instagram, and some leaflets with the stuff they do. Some really nice bits and pieces on there, hoodies, sweatshirts, t-shirts, mugs, and all other sorts of merchandise. I've got a few other friends that play instruments and stuff, so I'm going to be handing these out to them. And Tim has very kindly sent me through a t-shirt to have a look at and a ceramic mug. Uh, not ceramic, sorry, enamel mug to see what I think of and give you guys my honest opinion. Now with the t-shirt, in order to sort of like show a bit of wear and tear and see how the t-shirt performs, first thing I do when I get a t-shirt is I put it through three hour long washers not obviously on its own because that's just a waste of water and electricity but obviously with other clothing and stuff when we do the washing i'll put it through which simulates a bit of wear and tear gives me a rough idea how the design's going to stand out the t-shirt's going to stand out and everything so that's the way that i do it this was the t-shirt that was sent through dun 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 i need more guitar and studio wear nice sort of like design on there there's loads of different designs depending on what sort of instruments you're into and what you do in the music world um i believe he does custom ones as well very soft t-shirt and da -da -da -da. the t-shirt itself is an anvil lightweight t-shirt it's uh 100 cotton size small and it fitted perfectly because i do have an issue with t-shirts when i go out and buy them whether i'm a medium or a small because sometimes mediums are just right sometimes smalls are just right sometimes mediums are too long and end up looking like some sort of demented maxi dress sometimes small are too small and make me look like i've been shrink wrapped which is never a good look for anyone so the small fitted perfectly just the right arm length halfway down my arm not too tight under the armpits it was perfect so after putting it through the wash three times wash it dry it wash it dry it wash it dry it I've had no issues with this whatsoever. It's a ribbed collar on this. Decent material. I've had no issues with the stitching coming apart. No loose threads or anything like that. There's no bobbling of it. It's not suddenly gone baggy and lost its shape. Because you do find that with a lot of the sort of cheaper t-shirts that they kind of just lose their shape and lose their sort of colour and start fading. I know all t-shirts do after time, but... Yep, absolutely no problems with the stitching. This is, I believe, one of those tubular bodies ones. There's no actual stitching down the side or anything, but all the hemline is fine on it. There's a thread there, but that's just where it's finished off. Um, but no issues whatsoever. They come in a variety of uh, colours as well. I think there's white one, there's colour logos and black t-shirts. And it's nice that these are all designed in-house and... <coughs> Really, really nice. No problem with any peeling, cracking, or anything of the graphics on there, which is nice. Nothing worse than getting a t shirt and within a few washes it's all peeling off, which is why I had to put it through the wash. And it was on a 30 degree hour long wash. Absolutely fantastic. And the t shirts are unisex, come in sizes from small up to extra large, and they're coming in at 16 quid. I think that's pretty cool. It's kind of average for a t-shirt anywhere. I would pay for a t-shirt anywhere between tw 10, 25, maybe 30 quid at a push if I really like the design on it. And I like the fact that Tim's found a niche in the market, something he couldn't find because being a musician and a sound engineer, and that he decided to create it itself. And really, really good idea. And he has also sent me through a new mug because as you know, I've always got a mug of coffee on the go during my reviews and throughout the day, to be honest. Two things I can't do without in life, my wife and a coffee. Enamel mug. This has got, you can never have too many uh, guitar licks on it. Studioware.co.uk. Let's say all the stuff is drop shipped, so 
doesn't have to worry about holding stock. This is not dishwasher or microwave safe, obviously not microwave safe because it's metal and so you're not supposed to put stuff in microwaves that's metal unless you want a really nice lightning show going on in your kitchen. Dishwasher safe, I've washed this by hand. It does get a bit warm. This usual mug that I do use, um, it's kind of like double walled, so it tends to hold in the heat a bit more. But it's nice, it's a nice mug. And they do the ceramic china mugs as well as this one. It's an 11 ounce, it's hand enameled too. I've had no issues with any of the logos or anything coming off which is nice, nice to see it's been put on there straight because I have had mugs in the past and everything's a bit on the skew with, but everything's on there straight. Really, really nice. Decent solid handle on there. There's nothing worse than having the mug and then the handle comes off, especially with the ceramic, uh, with the enamel ones or these ones. Price on these, £9.50. And the thing I like about these mugs as well is I can take them outside, I can drop them, I can kick them. Yeah, it's going to scratch or whatever, but they're a lot more hard wearing, which is what I like. And I'd quite happily pay £9.50 on a mug. Um, I will be using this in my reviews. In fact, I think it's clean inside from when I wash it out. There you go. New mug for the reviews. Cool. So thank you so, so much for Tim for sending these through. Really, really nice products, really well made. Um, I love the fact that you're creating something that you have a passion for, which is great to see because I do like it when these people kind of want something, they can't find it, so they basically have the skill set or they learn how to do something so they can make it themselves. <coughs> Very well priced, loads of different designs depending on what instrument you play or if you just like music in general. Links will be down below in that very description box. So please give them some support and a help and a follow. Thank you so, so much, Tim. I wish you all the success for the future. And I'll be using that when I wear my t-shirt, when I play my guitar and drinking out my mug. So thank you so much. I hope you guys have a wonderful day out there wherever you are. Please stay safe because it's still blinking windy and the sea is churned up like nothing out there it looks like a milkshake um so yeah have a great day thank you to tim links down below anybody needs any help support anything whatsoever please get in touch with me hope you're enjoying what i'm doing here and please join me for the next review from me matt the bearded berserker have a great day guys really appreciate each and every one of you thank you